Hey guys, this is Red. Um, I'm doing an, this uh, free game um, this week from PlayStation Plus. It's called Outland. It's by Ubisoft. And I did not know it was a side-scroller. And I bought Blood Rain Betrayal, which I thought was a better game than this. This is a first impressions, and the first impressions of this game thought it might be alright. I didn't think it was going to be a side scroller, but I didn't look too into the game. Like, it was just a free game I downloaded from PlayStation Plus. And they even have, like, a cool little story apparently to it. Um, this is the first, like, almost 10 minutes of the game. Like, I'm really bad at side scrollers for some reason. That God did not give me a good gift with side scrollers, so. I just suck with them <laughs> and I could not get into this game at all like I don't mind like a game that has if graphics that are kind of different I will tell you of I've a seen man so many games flowers world like there's games like journey that look different like this game just doesn't remind me of one of the games it's could not help him. all around bad terrible game to me Visions drove and him you on. could disagree with me. Um, this is just what, how I feel a about the game. He sought, you can a totally teacher, disagree about a mystic. But yeah, out of side scrollers, this is not my favorite. I played side scrollers on the PlayStation One, and heal him. I thought they were much better. Maybe he that's why this was a free game. <laughs> collapsed at his fire. That's why I decided to give it to you. For free. It is not worth ten dollars. I wouldn't pay anything for it. But Stories of a I great didn't, wheel. So. Endlessly and this isn't even the demo version. This is the actual game itself. Of two sisters who helped yeah. make the Here's world. The, I don't know whatever this whole story and is. Then I, to I didn't really care for it too much. It's like, okay. <laughs> Imprisoned by a hero. So, a soul yeah. waiting for My impressions ages, of this game. Um, eager don't to buy be it. Reborn. Save ten dollars if you have PlayStation Plus, and you'll. And His you, time you can has just pick it up. Again. It's free, so yeah, try it out. But so has there. For people that do like side scrollers, on the other the hand, earth um, trembles in fear. It did have, it did have some different things. Like they have, you can pick up a sword and stuff. You can. I don't know how all side scrollers are. Like some, mm. they don't have like anything. Oh, the only side scroller I ever liked was like Blade Kitten. That was a fun game. I think I have that on my other channel, and I might have it on this channel too. Might have been one of the first videos I uploaded. But Blade Kitten is a very, that's actually a fun one. I, and it had a little story to it. It didn't really get as much, like, credit as like, it should have. As you can see here, like, I, I actually cut off, like, I actually died, like, there at the very beginning somewhere. Because I, I didn't know what I was supposed to be doing here first I was like okay so I just keep going over and over <laughs> it doesn't really give you a direction like after this point like it doesn't really give you a direction of where to go like you have to go backwards it doesn't really give you a direction and that kind of made me angry too but if you do like side scrollers I just I don't know I don't think I still would recommend it because it's not that interesting to me it's, it's just not that interesting of a game to pay 10 bucks for so maybe if it goes on sale for like two bucks or a dollar i'd pay that if i liked side scrollers but it, it's not even like to me it's not like a good playstation one side scrolling game so why would you pick it up if it's a ps3 one and it's supposed to be like better than playstation one to me, it's not, it's not worth the value of $10. Um, I don't know how much more I can say about it, but this is the gameplay of me pretty much dying. You Basically, and you have to have patience for the side scroller. Usually, side scrollers are fast paced and stuff. Like, you don't have to wait for stupid little beams of, like, alien substance coming out at you. You don't have to wait to go past them. That kind of makes me angry too. Is like, geez, just let me go. And then, at the very end of this level, I don't, I don't know if this is even the end. It might be midway through. Because I just got tired and I turned it off. Um, 
Yeah, it's like, once you get to the end, you get a sword, and then, once you get a sword, you're supposed to be able to go backwards, I guess, but they don't tell you where to go from there. It's, it's kind of like Fear 2, in that, like, it didn't, doesn't show you where you should go afterwards. Like, Fear 2 had a lot of that problem. And this game, I just don't, wouldn't recommend it. You heard what I have to say. Um, enjoy the rest of the gameplay, I guess. If you like seeing me die, then you're going to be happy. You get to see me die all the time. <laughs> um, yeah, I just wouldn't recommend this game. Even for side-scroller people, I would not recommend it. It, it just doesn't seem like it would be fun, even if you like side-scrollers, to me. That's just me. Even, even Blood Rain Betrayal was it was a hard game for me, and I like that better than this. I even played it longer. <laughs> this game, I, I just want to give my time to it. Okay. Um, subscribe if you like the video. This is my first time doing this type of thing.